Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to easily fix the Windows Update error code 0x800704.5d on Windows 11 in no time. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to run the Windows Update Troubleshooter. Now to do this press the Windows button and select the settings icon and afterwards make sure to click on system on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find the troubleshoot category and just click on this category. Now in here just select other troubleshooters and the last thing you have to do is click on the run button next to Windows Update. Now Windows will try to detect any issues and fix them as soon as possible. You can then close these windows, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to run the hardware and devices troubleshooter. Now to do this press the Windows button then simply type CMD and then run command prompt as an administrator. And in here, in the command prompt window, make sure to type in the following command. Now simply press on enter and you will see that a new window will appear. From here on just click on next and afterwards the tool will start scanning for any problems with your hardware and recommend a fix. After it is done, try again with Windows Update and check if the error still persists. Moving on, another great solution is to run the DISM and SFC scans. To do this, press the Windows button then simply type CMD and then run command prompt as an administrator. And in here, in the command prompt window, make sure to type in the following commands, but press enter after each command. Now, on pressing enter after each command, you'll see that the scans will take a bit of time, so don't lose patience. Just wait a bit until they're finished, and you can just restart your computer and check if the error still persists. Next in line, another great solution is to perform a clean boot. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type msconfig and then select system configuration from the search results. Now what you have to do in here is firstly navigate to the services tab and make sure to tick the box next to hide all Microsoft services. Now what you have to do is simply click on the disable all button and then just press on apply and ok to save the changes. Now you can just restart your computer and then check if the problem still persists. And lastly another useful solution is to perform a system restore. To do this press the windows button then type in rstrui and select it as a run command from the search results. Now in here just click on next and then choose the earliest point in time before the problem occurred then click on next once again and lastly select the finish button to start the restoration procedure. Now just wait until it's all done your computer will then restart and then you can check if the problem still persists. However, as an alternative, we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time, Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware, which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it, super simple, isn't it? Of course, if this video helped you, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.